All right, things are certainly looking good around here right now. Let me give you an idea what to expect forecast wise. You've got till eight o'clock tonight if you want to come down, get some chow. Also, we've got the band that's going to start at six o'clock and uh, we're going to certainly check in with them. So here's what we're doing for temps. We have spent the day in the 80s. It has been pretty hot and the humidity levels have not exactly helped a lot because, uh, you know, it's been sticky. So here's what we're doing for dew point temperatures. If you take a look at these, when you're up into the 60s, you know, it's getting pretty sticky. And when you get up near 70 degrees, then it's really sticky. So, you know, I've been saying this for a while here. There's a lot of shade. So there's no worry getting out of the sun at all. And of course, the sun is going to go down in a few hours. So that'll be good. All right, let's show you what's up with Storm Tracker. If you look back to the west here, after a mainly clear sky, uh, we do have a little action. I think we're going to find some rain showers tomorrow, especially in the morning. I think we end up with a little bit of sunshine by later in the day. So first warning weather goes like this for you. Tonight is going to be pretty good. Honestly, it's going to be uh, pretty muggy, though. Could find a few showers overnight. Temperature is going to be in the 70s for many of us. And if you don't see 70s, we will be in the upper 60s. So then for tomorrow, it goes like this. In the morning, could find a few showers. We do think it's going to be drier in the afternoon. We do get into the 80s in a lot of places, Burlington over to Montpelier, even St. Johnsbury, and then point south from there. So let's extend this thing out. I know a lot of people thinking about the weekend. We go from that 83 to 80 on Saturday and a few showers possible, but I think most of that day is going to be dry. And Sunday's a little bit shaky with a couple of showers too. But again, I think when you look at each day over the weekend, it's going to be pretty good. So Monday, an isolated storm, a better chance for storms come Tuesday, Wednesday, some scattered showers. And note that toward the end of the five day forecast, not even the end, but before it, maybe I should say the 10 day forecast starts to get cooler with temperatures in the 70s.